Underwater. Very, very rainy, very gloomy. The, uh, the tropical low severe thunderstorm is barreling down Russell Island. Holy f Holy f you know, this, this is not looking good. As you can see, we've got dark skies. Yeah, so I, think that, I think that counts to eight souls. Right, hee ho. Next day. A big footpath right alongside here. Looks like my prayers have been answered. It's the next day, Islanders, and the sun's starting to finally come out here, and they're obviously continuing on with the footpath or job, which I think is long overdue. We've, we, I've been, I've been begging for a new footpath, and it's finally happening. They listen to me for once. Oh, we've got a whole convoy of people coming through as well. Islanders, which is... Well, at least now, at least now, when we get to the footpath from the family office, we will be fine, because we're obviously not going to... We're obviously not going to be dumping and rolling into the dirt car park. Even though about 80% of the time it's obviously going to happen that you will obviously be ran over anyway. Because some people on Russell Island don't care. Some people do, and they'll be like, oh, okay, I'll wait for him. And then others are like, nah, just keep going. Because I, I, know, I know exactly how the system works. Yeah, they, they, um, that, that, that other passenger ferry, the old one. Uh, of course, they put their motorcycles in the place they shouldn't, but because because we're not using that ferry terminal anymore, uh, I'm not going to really worry about that. To be perfectly honest with you, we're not. I'm not going to be bothered using that path again. So, you know, if you if you want to park a vehicle there or bikes there, then be my guest. That space right there is one less thing to worry about. Yeah, so we've got the vehicle right here, before we prepare to stop. Now we're going to come on down to the car park. going a little bit more forward and then I'll, then I'll show the islanders. Alright, so here you'll find a few people around and look at that, they're, fin they're finally putting in the, uh, the, um, the side the side right there, so they're obviously putting in the siding and everything, so that's good. So they're really starting to build this car park right here. So that's, that's good, that's good. They're obviously making it a much more efficient parking place because remember before just how terrible it looked I do have footage of what the old one used to look like Islanders I think you've probably seen it in other Island Life episodes as well and particularly those before yeah, so episodes, so the first 650 episodes or so um, should have what the car park looked like before it was closed off to the public So yeah, we're pretty lucky to obviously see that behind us there and in all of that. <laughs> yeah, so. Well, there you have it, Islanders. So there, there, there's your uh, there's your update right there at the car park ferry terminal and the new footpath that I was promised. I'll see you later. Right Islanders, well, there doesn't seem to be much going on around here. Um, we've come to the end of the day. Definitely the end of the day. So, yeah, that's about it for me. So I really do hope that you Islanders have had a good one. I will definitely be having to very soon hand over, uh, turn in for the night, 
because um, I've got a big day tomorrow. Um, I'm going to be over at Wellington Point and then Maclay Island. So I've got a very, very big day tomorrow. And of course, it's a long time coming for me for this one. But it's been long awaited and it's finally happening. And I, I said, I said if there was no, no action taken on their end, I'll do it on my end. So they've obviously took it upon themselves to activate it on their end rather than mine. Which I think is good because now I can hopefully get this issue hopefully resolved and get and you know clear the air and all of that sort of thing as well with what's happening because things have obviously not been going too well for me um, as you islanders have probably guessed <clears throat> because a lot of things have gone wrong for me and you islanders have clearly noticed that. No, not this time. This time we're obviously going to go on the right way. We're going to go in the correct direction this time. No more delays, no more crossing this way, crossing that way in the wrong direction. No. That's not happening anymore. Those days are behind us. And where they should hopefully stay. Because I don't want to have to go through this again. All the stress and anger and everything. Like I don't need that in my life anymore. That part, that part is over. So I really do hope that you Islanders will obviously stay on board tomorrow's episode. Um, to where we can obviously go through all this. So that's about it for me for now. But if I do pick up again, I'll obviously be going through a few more things. Um, but if not, I'll see you tomorrow. Don't forget to click below and subscribe to the official Island Life YouTube channel.